Hello friends, today I will show you how to generate a consolidated e-bible. Consolidated e-bible means uh, this is uh, if you transport goods uh, uh, in a vehicle which contains more than one e-bible, that means uh, more than one document or if it is a transport agency or parcel agency, something like that, you have to transport the goods uh, in bulk. That means uh, one or one or uh, two or more e-bibles together in a vehicle. Then, as per the rules, you have to print out, take, print out all the e bills and keep it in a vehicle. In order to avoid such such situation, you can generate an e generate a consolidated e bill. In other conditions, if uh, if two or more e bills are transporting in a vehicle, and if you want to change that vehicle, you have to regenerate all these e bills to, uh, one by one. In order to avoid such uh, such difficulties. The consolidated e-bill is a very very good advantage. Before generating a consolidated e-bill, first you have to generate a single e-bill. Single e-bills that uh, can be generated for your own vehicle or for your transporter. If for your vehicle, you have to generate uh, the e-bill with uh, uh, your vehicle number. The also, if you have more than uh, you, if you assign a vehicle, assign a goods, assign an e bill to a transporter, you should generate the e bill using a transporter ID of the transporter. Okay, if you are generating your own vehicle, first you have to generate e uh, bill using your vehicle number, and then uh, generate a consolidated e bill using that e bill numbers. I also, if you if you uh, also if you authorize uh, to uh, uh, some other transport agency for transporting these goods, you should generate uh, that uh, transport ID in the transport ID column. Then the transporter can log into his system and uh, generate a consolidated. First, uh, I am presently I am generating an e consolidated e bill from the two e bills I have generated from this. Uh, this uh, the same dealer for the same dealer you can uh, please remember that you can transport the goods uh, even uh, even though you are not a transporter you can transport the goods of your friends or uh, your uh, uh, other uh, friends businessmen that uh, if your vehicle have enough space to transport the goods of uh, other other ta other tax person other traders you can transport that goods if uh, the taxpayer has provided uh, your gst in or uh, your gst in your transport ready column Okay, first uh, you yourself transporting the goods uh, it, that in your own vehicle or your own leads vehicle that it contains three, two or three EA bills. Then how to generate a consolidated bill? First, uh, we have to generate an EA bill. How? And then you please remember that uh, you can watch my earlier video regarding the how to generate an EA bill, how to generate uh, masters and easy to generate masters, use uh, sub users in my channel. YouTube.com slash joy k o r t t y s h j o y k o r t t y so search in Google for s h j o y k o r t t y either same address has been provided at the comment box uh, at the description uh, description of this video you can uh, get that uh, link also now how to generate uh, an e bill using a uh, document <coughs> first simply okay now I generating a selecting tax invoice we can outward and inward out to that uh, then document number I have under 45 now date uh, it is 26 I am generating now I generating the 25th okay and this uh, concern column is okay and now change that uh, concern column to Kerala and again <coughs> and again I now entering that uh, my concern is uh, GST and concern is GST and is uh, this uh, and uh, I j now enter and uh, now I enter the GST in column, sorry, GST in column and uh, tab key and all the data has been filled, uh, then automatically filled from the registration letter. If you produce, please don't forget that if you don't have a GST, you should type URP in GST in column instead of GST, in, type URP, URP key in GST in column, otherwise you can use uh, that uh, GST, then data will be automatic. You can still, you can edit that data okay you can edit that also also if you want to change the address or uh, consign his address okay now i adding uh, products uh, from masters uh, then uh, products then uh, i added sugar uh, and uh, sugar bag i enter now hsm code i now enter 87 as an hsm code quantity i have entered a 500 uh, that unit i have to enter that what is the unit that's the bags for that is bgs for bags uh, uh, you just uh, also the mouse you can see that uh, what are the units applicable correct code you should enter otherwise system show an error 
ഓക്കെ അത് ഞാൻ നവ് ഐ എൻ്ററിങ് ബി ജി എസ് ഫോർ ബാക്സ് നവ് ടോട്ടൽ ടാക്സ് വാല്യൂ ട്വൻറ്റി തൗസൻഡ് ഐ എൻ നവ് എൻ്ററിങ് നവ് റേറ്റ് ഓഫ് ടാക്സ് ഈ ഫിഫ്റ്റി ഫൈവ് പെർസെൻറ്റ് ജസ്റ്റ് ടെൻ ടു പോയിൻറ്റ് ഫൈവ് ഇൻ സി ജി എസ് ടി കോളം ടു പോയിൻറ്റ് ഫൈവ് ഇൻ എസ് ജി എസ് ടി കോളം ആൻഡ് ഇൽ ഓട്ടോമാറ്റിക്കലി സീറോ കംസ് ടു ഐ ജി എസ് ടി കോളം നവ് സെസ് കോളം ഐ ലെവൻ സീറോ യു ക്യാൻ ദിസ് ആൽ സി എസ് ഐ സെസ് സി ജി എസ് ജി എസ് ജി എസ് ടി ഐ ജി എസ് ടി എൻ സെസ് ദെൻ നൗ ഇഫ് മോർ ദാൻ വൺ കമ്മ്യൂണിറ്റി യു ക്യാൻ ആഡ് ദാറ്റ് കമ്മ്യൂണിറ്റി ഓൾസോ ഇഫ് ഡോൺ ഹാവ് ദിസ്റ്റ് ലീവ് ഇറ്റ് നൗ ഐ എൻ്ററിങ് ദിസ് സെയിം ബൈ അപ്രോക്സിം ഡിസ്റ്റൻസ് ഇസ് ടു ഹൺഡ്രഡ് കിലോമീറ്റേഴ്സ് നൗ എൻ്ററിങ് ടു ഹൺഡ്രഡ് കിലോമീറ്റേഴ്സ് ദെൻ ഇഫ് ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് ടു ഹൺഡ്രഡ് ആൻഡ് ടെൻ ഇറ്റ് ഇസ് ടു ഹൺഡ്രഡ് ടെൻ എൻ്ററിങ് ടു ഹൺഡ്രഡ് ടെൻ ഇറ്റ് വിൽ ബി വാലിഡി ഫോർ ത്രീ ഡേയ്സ് ടു ഹൺഡ്രഡ് പ്ലസ് ഹൺഡ്രഡ് പ്ലസ് ടെൻ ഇസ് ത്രീ ഡേയ്സ് വാലിഡി നൗ ഐ എൻ്ററിങ് ഇൻ എ വെഹിക്കിൾ നമ്പർ എസ് കെ എൽ ടെൻ എ ഫോർ ഫൈവ് സെവൻ എയ്റ്റ് എസ് വെഹിക്കിൾ നമ്പർ നൗ ഐ എൻ്ററിങ് ദറ്റ് ഫോർ ഫൈവ് സെവൻ എയ്റ്റ് എസ് വെഹിക്കിൾ നമ്പർ നൗ ഐ എൻ്റർഡ് ആൻഡ് ജനറേറ്റിംഗ് ദറ്റ് ജനറേറ്റിംഗ് ദ യു ബിൽ that the driver bill will be generated now you can see that the uh, driver bill number has been generated uh, this is the driver bill number and generated by me valid from valid to that you will get 3 days validity for 210 km then the gst now the uh, uh, second party and also part b the bike has been entered and uh, this is uh, the kl10 s4578 if you want you can print a detail print uh, Uh, if you want otherwise uh, you you know uh, it is not necessary to take detailed print out of the uh, eway bill it is very simple okay now i note down that uh, eway bill number eway bill number okay now i note that uh, in eway bill number here now this uh, believe it now again i again uh, second uh, eway bill number i am now generating uh, generating new another eway bill i now, now generate uh, for another party now i am entering uh, this is uh, outboard and everything is in tax invoice now it is a challan delivery challan i have taken time sub types as others and uh, delivery challan dc 45478778 now again i uh, don't changing that address and uh, now i put another another gst in here and another gst in here then all the data has been filled now I, i change that address if you want uh, to change that pin code also you can say that pin code also now i change that and uh, adding commodity now i ending which 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 in packets packets uh, hs and i now enter uh, uh, simply 80 it is no may not be correct now can't it 500 500 kg bags uh, unit that means uh, it is in uh, by this is a kgs this is what i ended kgs as the unit unit now value 25000 and, and now it is in that i have ended this is from my pradesh and it is kerala therefore it is igst therefore first i have to change that also in order to avoid the confusion over that okay now i ended that is and again i ended otherwise if you want to change the address first delete the commodity that you have entered otherwise the system will not allow you to change okay first i now enter which which uh, then which in fax now it is an i have entered it earlier now it is 500 then uh, kgs i entered now value is 25 1000 and the gst is 2.5 and 2.5 this zero okay now the total value is uh, reported here now again i transport the uh, in another vehicle another vehicle i have transported in another vehicle okay you should uh, note that uh, k11 uh, 45 7800 now and now i am generating in sorry distance i have forgot the distance to 120 i have entered now 120 okay sir net now entered sorry again pin code has uh, some mistakes that's uh, okay we get here i have to enter some pin code uh, now so i now enter something that again blank invalid blank supplier pin code supplier pin code means uh, second blank okay 
three times if it's a mistake, otherwise the system is short of an error. Okay, now I ended up this is two GSTN. Now, what to do is to generate a consolidated. Now, the vehicle has been ready here. Now, I want to uh, transport this together in a vehicle. Now, I have to get that EVA bill first. First, you have to note down what are the EVA bills that I have been generated. EVA bills, then uh, uh, first uh, go to reports, then you can see that uh, my EVA bill reports is here. My EVA bill reports that, that has been generated by me and uh, cancelled the EVA bills. My the EVA bills cancelled by me within 24 hours and uh, for inverse supplies, outward supplies, supply you get generated by me. And the rejected EVA bills by me that has been the rejected EVA bills that has been generated by others and rejected by me. And uh, you can also see that uh, my EVA bills and others EVA bills. Others EVA bills means that uh, you have the, the EVA bills has been generated by others, but uh, you may have the second party that has been generated again generated on behalf of you and uh, rejected by others others that you have generated and uh, you, the variable bill has been rejected by others. As I mean to transport means that uh, if you are a transporter or even a taxpayer, you have uh, you will get uh, you have been assigned to transport some others uh, EVA some others uh, uh, consumers. In that case, you, the, you have to give their GSTN or transport GSTN in the transport column and it will be displayed in this report. Then master's uh, reports. Are there. Then uh, now I go to my available reports. My reports and then output report supplies that I think we have generated today. Two uh, available has been generated today. <laughs> now click go. Then what are the available sites? No, available, sorry. Sorry, one minute. Okay, now I generate any a consolidated available with uh, that uh, EVA bills that has been generated uh, individually. If this is uh, useful that uh, when these two invoices or two or more uh, EVA bills are transported, EVA goods are transported along with the EVA bill, you need not uh, print take note all the EVA bills. You just uh, generate a consolidated EVA bill and uh, you can uh, update uh, that uh, generate an EVA consolidated EVA bill. And if you change the vehicle, you can also update the vehicles. First, uh, how to generate a consolidated EVA bill? Just go to the consolidated EVA bill menu, then just click generate new, and you will provide with a screen where to select the state, etc. Then now you select the state and place I have selected. Here I have plus a selector, vehicle number, another vehicle number I have selected. Actually, actually I have given about two vehicle number there, or you can uh, use that vehicle also. Otherwise, you can generate, you use another another vehicle number here, that I, which you are actually transporting the goods. Okay, now I enter this vehicle. Now I enter this, uh, that uh, EVA bill number that has been generated here. This is the EVA bill number I have generated. Now go to that menu and uh, click, the paste that uh, EVA bill number or enter that number and put the tab key. Don't need need to type any any column. Just click tab key. Then all the data will be automatically filled. And again, second I adding plus, and again I uh, adding that uh, EVA bill number here and uh, pasting that. Or else you can type that and put tab key of your keyboard. Tab key. Just click tab key. Then all the data has been filled. Now click, if you, if you have more you can add plus button again and you can use that. Okay, click submit button and your consolidated eBay bill has been generated. You can see that the two eBay bill has been listed and you can take print out that. Uh, if you have more you can also, the list may extend up to that. You can QR code will be there. And that is the EVA bill consolidated EVA bill number. It is has been generated. Okay. Now I paste in that uh, in that my uh, web file here. This consolidated EVA bill. Now how to update that uh, EVA bill? Then just go to the menu. And uh, we uh, earlier in the case of EVA bill, you can update vehicle just like the update vehicle. You can update this EVA bill also. This is called a regenerate EVA bill. Regenerative bill means uh, you can uh, 
update the vehicle. The effect is that the updation of vehicle and other details is the regeneration of vehicle, regeneration of console bill. Generate bulk means using the Excel tool, Excel macro and Apple Excel tool. You can generate first generate the JSON file and upload the same to the server and server will up, server will generate a console available number. This number can be used for uh, for transporting goods. This print console ready console ready means you can this is the menu. Okay. Now how how to regenerate? Click the regenerate button and uh, console ready will click that the console ready will and click uh, go either you can select it uh, by date generate date uh, also you can select uh, that uh, also the evil has been uh, you can see that uh, okay now click go button now you can see that the evil has been uh, status has been shown as valid everything is shown here now the present vehicle number is displayed here now you can either you can uh, mode of transport can be changed to rail or air etc. You can change the mode of transport also. Now, what to do is that uh, now I am, I am uh, if it is place of change, uh, RR number, uh, everything you should enter. First, uh, you should enter the road, road, and uh, uh, then uh, enter another vehicle number KL11AJ9H. This number nine three two. Place of change now I change it to. Uh, uh, Camera series I have changed. Now state has been again changed. Reason reason may be due to breakdown or transshipment. What is maybe you should enter a breakdown reason. And if you have a transport number, you can enter that uh, transport number here. Otherwise, you need not enter. Otherwise, if you transshipment, you can also change it to transmission transshipment. Click submit button. And a new evable consolidated evable number has been generated. Okay. This you can see that the evable number and validity has not any change. Only the evable consolidated evable number has been changed. You should uh, remember that it is the way how to generate an evable. Okay, you can watch my channel on uh, again. I will say saying that uh, all other help videos are available at uh, my channel. That is youtube.com slash sjoyquality s h j o i k o r a t t y. You can use that uh, of that videos for. Uh, generating and modifying variables okay very thank you please subscribe to my channel okay thank you